Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you one simple design trick that will take your table visualization to the next level, giving it a modern and professional look. So enough of talking, let's dive in. And here we are in our Power BI test file. For this purpose, I have created one simple table visualization with data I would like to present. And next step that I'm going to do is I will format this table to look a little bit better so let's go to format pane under style presets go to style change it to minimal and under column headers change background color to black and text color to white now this looks a little bit better next step what we're going to do is we will need three measures to make this easier I uploaded these DAX measures to my GitHub page so you can just copy paste them, no need for typing or any advanced DAX knowledge, so just simple copy paste. Let's go to my GitHub page, it is saved under true and false pill folder. First let's copy true pill measure and this will be our first measure, Control C, measures table, new measure and control v press enter let's go back let's copy second measure that is false pill control c new measure control v and press enter and let's add third one and the final one that is in my case it is named table is hidden icon but we will rename it later control c measures table new measure and control v okay here we have error but let's leave it for now like this and press enter now let me explain you what we have created so first let's go to true pill measure the true pill measure creates a green rounded rectangle with black text inside the text display is defined by the display text variable, making it easy to customize the content shown within the pill. You can also change fill color, in my case this is green, and you can change text color. This will be black color. Also you can change width of this rounded rectangle. Let me go to false pill. False pill principle is the same, same width, same height. Fill color is red text color black and display text is false we can also change this if we want third measure that we will need let me go back to my table so for th third measure we will use total revenue column and here i have revenue by each product what i would like to see if this product is profitable i have a rule within my company and that is if product revenue is higher than 2000 then product is profitable otherwise if it's less than 2000 it is not profitable let's go to our third measure and let's rename it first is is product profit Now, instead of selected value equal to true, we will replace this with if total revenue is higher than 2000, then true pill, otherwise false pill. Close brackets, press enter, and now let's add this measure to our table. Let's expand it and as a result we got this some text without any meaning and what we need to do and that is final touch we need to change this measure to image so select measure go to measure tools and under data category change this to image url and here it is you see total revenue whenever is revenue higher 
2000 result will be true if it's less than 2000 result is false of course as i mentioned before you can change text from false to no or anything else let's do that to just show you let's go to false pill and let's change this from false to that press enter and you see text is changed simple as that you can also change color let me show you also how you can do that let's change text color to light hex code and just type hex code select any page select white and here it is it's this is the hex code for white and let's change it text color to white and we need to remove this one and okay and here it is now text is white you can change any color you want and that's it we can do this for any column we want and this looks much better this formatting is something that catches the eye it really stands out value we want to present and this is something that you definitely should have in your tables if you want to impress your end users if you found this video helpful please give it a like and subscribe for more power bi tips write me in the comments what do you think and thank you for watching see you in my next one